be showing you how to cook pepper soup using only three pepper soup spices. Please don't forget to hit the like button, share with your friends, and also subscribe to my channel. Now let's start cooking. So these are my ingredients for this soup. For this recipe, I'll be using sea bream fish. You can use catfish or tilapia. Here I have two garlic cloves, ginger, habanero peppers, chopped peppers, which is optional. I have onion, two stock cubes, basil leaves, which is also known as curry leaves in Nigeria. I have here scent leaf. Don't mind the color. They just came out of the freezer. I have here salt and here I have my ehuru, ehuru seed about eight these are called calabash nutmeg as well I have the seeded uda and I have a tablespoonful of uziza seeds these three are the main ingredients of any pepper soup to add that authentic pepper soup flavor you need these three otherwise you just be cooking water soup <laughs> sorry about that so all right guys let's start cooking so to begin i'm going to blend the mixture of garlic ginger onion and pepper and i'm going to set aside and i'm going to blend the three pepper soup spices ehuru uziza and uda and i'm going to set aside now i'm going to be transferring the fish into the pot then I'm going to season with my stock cubes and salt. Be careful of the quantity of salt you're using. Next, I'll add my blended pepper mixture. At this point, I'll be adding the blended pepper soup spices. I'm adding all this together from the beginning. Like we all know, fish doesn't take time to cook. So we'd want all the seasoning, all the spices to go in into the fish to be tasty. So I'm going to be adding water. And I'm going to add more water if needed. You can add as much water as you want. And I'm going to cook for about 11 minutes. After 11 minutes... I'm going to taste for salt. But with mine, I'm not going to add extra salt. So after testing for salt, I'm adding the scent leaves. And I will allow to cook for about two minutes. Now two minutes over. So I'm going to open my pot and I'll add the curry leaves. And pepper soup is ready. So you don't want the fish to be scattered, so you need to stir gently. So guys, the soup is ready, and this is what it looked like after cooking. And it tasted so delicious. This soup is perfect for any flu season. You can eat this with rice, yam, boiled potatoes, or bread. Whatever you want to eat it with is perfect please share your comment below and let's know how i did it bye bye and see you in my next video